<laughs> Hi, everybody. This is Deb Connor, Southern Indiana Rescue Effort, again at the Davis County Animal Shelter. And look at this baby. Tell me this is not beautiful. This guy's name is Noah, and he's probably about 10 months old. Hi, honey. He's a coon hound, and he's not very big, but he is an adult weight and height. Um, his name is Noah again. Um, this guy basically has been at the DCAC since June. And he's been dog tested. He's great with dogs. Um, of course, supervision, supervision with any dog, uh, with either dogs or cats, is a must. And that is the owner's responsibility. Uh, this guy is a staff favorite. And no wonder. He just gives kisses is all he does. That, he lives to give kisses. Hi. He's giving kisses. Those are coon dog kisses. Yeah, not just any kisses. They're not pit bull kisses. They're coon dog kisses. Oh, look at the buggies. He's a baby, folks. This guy has been a stray, and he's got the most exemplary temperament you could possibly imagine. He's just wonderful. Uh, Noah is a no issues dog, no dominance, not even with food. He's just a big, happy, goofy galoot. <laughs> Deb, tell him how good this boy is. He's precious. Yeah, yeah, he's a puppy. Gentle. This is a puppy, sweet folks. Sweet and playful. This is a puppy. Good with other dogs. He's good with other dogs, and he's good with kids too. He'll take treats gently from a child. Um, when you get Noah, you're basically knowing what you're going to be in for, which is basically a wonderful, wonderful family companion. Look at this boy. And he's just a puppy, folks. Come on, man. Do any of you guys out there want a good dog? This guy would be great indoors. I, as a rescuer, have placed coon dogs um, that have later become house pets. You know, the old myth that the coon dog is supposed to be outside or he won't hunt or he won't this or that. Discount that. And this boy here is, is not wanting to hunt. He's not wanting to hunt, folks. He wants a home with somebody to love him and take care of him and somebody to go camping with, you know, and walks around the park. That's what he wants. And you know what? We're gonna give that to him. We're gonna find somebody, hi honey. Look at this, look at this. We're gonna find somebody that wants Mr. Noah. Yes, we are, Deb, look at him. Deb, I think he loves you. I love him too. He's a puppet. <laughs> he's a puppy. Yes, he's a puppet puppy. <laughs> Folks, this guy's been at the DCAC again since June. He's heartworm negative. He's a great dog. A great dog in every aspect. Please, please, please. If you're even considering adding, <laughs> adding a treasured, very safe, gentle dog to your pack. Okay, Noah's the dog for you. Okay, that's what we're saying now. Yeah, look at him. He's doing the play bow. He knows what the play bow means. It means, by gosh, I want to play and I want to play now. Okay, folks. Noah, he's not even a year old. I'd say he's between six and nine months old. You gonna look at the camera? You gonna make me have to keep going around you for space here? Yeah. I think he's allergic to publicity. <laughs> All right, folks. Southern Indiana rescue effort out. And please, come on, guys. He is on, Noah is on the urgence list. Um, the staff at animal controls do have to put animals down for space and it's not their fault, so let's not pretend that it is let's put the blame where the blame lays and that's with the public but you know what folks you can save this beautiful boy you can save him all right honey we're gonna find you a home baby dog southern indiana rescue effort out 